Hello there, Michigan PGA. It's your president, Kevin McKinley, coming to you with the March update. Uh, many of you probably actually have your golf courses open already. Uh, but this March update is uh, all about how you can connect with other PGA professionals. Uh, maybe some of you need some MSR points still, and there's several opportunities upcoming that I want to share with you. Um, and this video will actually uh, help you out with that. In addition, uh, we're going to highlight a fantastic PGA up and coming professional uh, and then also talk to you a little bit about what is shaping up to be an unbelievable tournament uh, calendar and it's highlighted with a move of the Michigan Open back to Grand Traverse Resort in the Bear and we can't be more excited about that. So I hope you enjoy the update and uh, we'll look forward to seeing you soon at uh, one of our upcoming meetings. On March 12th, Bob Ackerman hosts 20th Century Methods for a 21st Century Process at Wabi Country Club. And Bob's bringing to town Mike Hebron, a National PGA Hall of Famer and the 1991 PGA of America Teacher of the Year. It's one you don't want to miss. March 26th is our spring meeting at Eagle Eye Golf Club. We're excited to share a bunch of things that will hopefully inspire you for a great 2018 season. We're going to open the meeting with an honor guard led by my friend Sergeant Jason Fuller. And we're looking for a PGA member or family or friend of a PGA member that would be willing to sing the national anthem. Contact Kevin McKinley if you're interested. We're excited about the education after the meeting, led by PGA of America's own Todd Sammons, Director of Member Education, and Dawes Marlott, the PGA Senior Director of Education and Employment. Coming up in April, our chapters will have their spring meetings as well. Prior to each meeting, an officer of the section will deliver a one-hour Michigan section presentation, earning you a bonus MSR. We'll start in the Eastern Chapter at Lion Oaks on April 16th, then to the Northern Chapter at Arcadia Bluffs on April 18th, the Western Chapter at the beautiful Kalamazoo Country Club April 22nd, and finally our senior organization will meet at Eagle Eye Golf Club on April 24th. I couldn't be more excited to highlight this month's member, Andre Pillow, the Program Director for the First Tee of West Michigan. He's recently been selected into the 2018 class of PGA LEAD. He's one of only 15 members from around the country with that distinction. I'm Andre Pillow, PGA Professional and Development Coordinator for the First Tee of West Michigan. Recently accepted the 2018 LEAD position. Very excited about this opportunity. Great opportunity to network. Um, we are trying our best to become more diverse as an organization. Um, looking at females, minorities, um, people with disabilities, um, really to become more all-encompassing as we go into the future, to match our customer base. And I'm very excited about the networking opportunities. Um, Lynette at the home office has been great, and um, just building relationships and trying our best to be the face of a different PGA. I'd encourage you to watch the other video that is linked on this email, which is one that Andre recorded about Black History Month. Tournament season is upon us, and thanks to Justin Phillips, Ian Ziska, and his committee, we have a great season ahead of us. Starts out on April 30th with the Mercy Elite Club Car Spring Scramble at Eagle Crest. After a Pro Pro that sold out last year at Oakland Hills, we've followed it up with two great facilities, Bloomfield Hills and Franklin Hills, the Yamaha Bushnell Pro Pro on May 7th. May 21st, the PGA Reach Pro-Am at Point of Woods will take place. The ever-popular Adidas State Pro-Am will take place June 4 and 5 at Boyne Highlands. The Michigan Open moves back to the Bear June 11th through the 14th, and we are still taking sponsorships for the event, so any sponsorship lead should be given directly to Kevin Helm. Crystal Mountain not only hosts, but also sponsors the Michigan Women's Open on June 25th to 27th, and finally the Michigan PGA Junior Championship at Bedford Valley June 28 and 29. Well, that takes you through the first half of our tournament season, and the second half is just as good. So we hope to see you participating in those tournaments this year. We'll talk a lot more about it at the spring meeting, and we certainly hope that you take advantage of some of these great educational and connecting opportunities with other PGA professionals this spring. Take care. Hope you enjoyed the update. We'll see you soon.